Hello everyone. Today I'm back with the another custom ROM, AACP ROM, and it has got an Android version of 4.4.4. In this video, I'm going to show you the what are the features I got in this ROM. Mm, first of all, I'm going to I connected the OTG cable with the wireless mouse. I'm using wireless mouse, as you can see this. <clears throat> everything works fine, scrolling, right click, everything. It is another version. And the ASCP, they also included their, their own type of hmm, animation. This animation they are included. As you can see, the navigation buttons we got here like an Android L. Um, it looks cool. And all the customization lies in these two options: ROM control and ASCP extras. Here we can we can add everything. Um, in this ASCP extras, we have got uh, hello, Omni switch display and animation, slide shortcuts, slide shortcuts indicates uh, shortcuts we can put in this here, driving mode, active notification like active display as in the Moto X, uh, tile colors, this is the thing I found extra in this ROM, I did not see this feature in any ROM, custom ROM, here we can add the colors to the tiles according to our customization, I have uh, I, chosen these colors, you can select the random colors, uh, any, according to our wish red see so you can see the colors for change to the orange in this way the next thing app drawer we can place the shortcuts like app drawer in the side anyway in the left or right if you enable it mm, gesture anywhere uh, it is like we can right, bring it we can. I did not uh, include any gesture in this mode. This is a feature I got. Mm. And this uh, another extra feature I found in this ROM when compared to another ROM is this uh, connection manager. In this, we can use the 2G and the Wi Fi both parallelly, and we'll be getting the more internet speed. In this way, I can able to use my 2G internet with the Wi Fi at the both times to get the downloads complete very soon actually this feature is present in the S5 download manager mm. I got very shocked to see this feature in this ROM and the next thing um, LCD density as we know LCD. and now get back to the ROM controller this ROM controller you can find plenty of uh, options, customizations general general thing uh, we can put the lock screen background as a previous screen this way volume rocker awake uh, volume music controller everything the status bar um, double tapping the status bar will lock the screen we can enable it or disable it and the clock style um, position and they have the weird color of the clock uh, Net so they're showing the network speed and the toggles. You can shift the toggles according to our wish. Uh, you can customize them. We can add more toggles. Mm. This color toggles looks nice. Mm. And the hardware buttons, power menu, navigation bar. Here we can add up to five buttons. I mostly use the three buttons because it looks cool. I feel like I'm using like Android LA features in this note. Mm, navigation ring. Mm, and we can set here all the navigation ring. This way. Mm, animations. Uh, I don't know this ribbons. Installer. Yeah. Mm, so.
after using this ROM for up to a couple of days, I found this ROM more uh, enjoyable because of these features what are available in this ROM. I'm going to show you the Android benchmark I got in this ROM. Is it on 10,000? I think, yeah, 10,331. Okay, when coming to the school, coming to another ROM. Mm. Um, that's it, guys. Mm, I think uh, these are the special water available in this ROM. I'll come back the another custom ROM soon. Until then, mm, bye, guys.